How's it going guys? This is Pete from the Freedom in God YouTube channel. So Devonian rock layers and the fossils within them supposedly hailed from a time long before monkeys, dinosaurs or modern oak trees evolved. The Darwinian concept of plants and animals gradually gaining complexity over eons of natural selection paints a picture of simple to complex development. But do fossils show that? A newly discovered tree fossil from northwest China seems to be telling the opposite tale, that the growth structures in the world's earliest trees were perhaps even more complicated than in today's trees. These Devonian trees are called Cladox lopsids and only known from fossils. They had the three familiar plant tissues, leaf, stem and root, and had xylem strands to transport water and nutrients. But this extinct tree type also contained small internal strand bundles arranged in an outer ring. The entire center of the tree was hollow. As these ore trees grew, each strand broke loose from and then re-anchored to neighboring strands to make room for the tree's overall growth in both height and in girth. So in other words, the very first trees to have supposedly evolved possessed intricate structures and employed functions that no known living trees have. Cardiff University paleontologist Christopher Berry participated in the research. Published in the Proceeding of the National Academy of Sciences, he told Cardiff University News, There is no other tree that I know of in the history of the earth that has ever done anything as complicated as this. The tree simultaneously ripped its skeleton apart and collapsed under its own weight while staying alive and growing upwards and outwards to become the dominant plant of its day. This raises a provoking question. Why are the very oldest trees the most complicated? He offered no answer, but the creation model suggests one. Genesis teaches that God made all plants on day 3 of the creation week. If plants never evolved from simple to complex, then no wonder even the earliest of them revealed top level sophistication. The flood model also helped solve another aspect of the Claydox Lopset riddle. To call these fossil plants the earliest implies they lived millions of years before the later plants had supposedly evolved. But what if mere months or weeks separated Devonian layers from the sedimentary deposits that overlie them? The very fact fossils exist testifies to sudden and catastrophic burial beneath vast sediments before the living things had a chance to rot or get scavenged by hungry critters. And the extensive flat contacts above and below each layer as opposed to ruts and valleys that millions of years of erosion would have produced suggests each new layer quickly piled the top the one below it. These clues to a worldwide flood suggest that Claydox lobsters were not necessarily the earliest trees to evolve but were just the first trees to get buried and fossilized. Creation and the flood wash away millions of mythical years and help make sense of Claydox lobsters fossils, specially created and recently fossilized. No wonder the lowest trees were the most complicated. Thanks for watching guys and may you all have a blessed day.